Oh, hey, sorry. I was looking at horses on Instagram. Look at this beauty. Anyway, so tonight is n night nine of Sexy Nights of Christmas. I'm so glad you're here. Thanks for having me in your email. Um, tonight we're going to be talking about mood lighting. Mm. You can see I have a nice little fire going in the background, but not, most people don't have fireplaces in their, their bedrooms. Neither do I. This is my living room. Um, but it can be very helpful to have just some simple soft glow in your bedroom. Um, yesterday we talked about how to make a sexy bedroom. This is kind of an extension of that. A um, couple of things. Candles are great. If you live in an apartment and can't burn a, can't, can't burn a real candle, get one of these candles that has like the little um, battery in it so you can just uh, click it on and it gives a nice yellowish glow. You want, you want yellow. Um, try not to use those blue LED lights in your bedroom. Try to use a softer, more yellowish glow and it will help you feel better. Um, if you usually have sex with the lights off, I would challenge you to at least light a little candle um, just to help give some sort of context to shape and character and texture of your bodies together. Um, it can re really be sexy if you are comfortable with that. The last tip is about a candle. Choose a candle that you only burn when you're about to have sex. This can trigger you in your brain to release some great feel-good endorphins prior to having sex. If you only burn the candle when you're having sex, um, it will begin to trigger you to get aroused eventually. So um, it can be a little good trick for those times that maybe you're not super in the mood. Um, if you light the candle, then it can trigger those endorphins in your brain to say, oh, I love the smell of this candle. I love this fragrance because it reminds me of connecting with my partner. So those are tips for lighting and fragrance in your bedroom to help set the mood for uh, a more erotic experience. I hope you enjoyed our tip number nine for our sexy, uh, sexy nights of Christmas. If you need more help, click below to see my course that starts in January to help with the libido, sexual shame, and painful intercourse, among other things. All right, I will see you for night 10 tomorrow.